Yo, what's up everybody? It's been a while. Um, just recently modded my Wii to get the homebrew channel. <coughs> Pardon me, I'm kind of sick, but uh, yeah, this is for uh, all you people that got that Kirby uh, Return to Dreamland game. And uh, it ain't working out your USB loader. So I'm going to show you real, real quick that uh, it doesn't really work. I mean, you could probably modify the settings. But I've tried it all, and uh, it really doesn't really, it really doesn't work. So yeah, I've looked up ways to get it working on the USB loader. But for some reason, every time you start up the game, it'll, it'll freeze at the menu. Uh, I'm about to show you here right now, where uh, you know it's all fine in the beginning. You can play it, as you can see. I can press buttons, and uh, every time I, you know, start my game again, I press, I press two. And then uh, I go to the main main mode, and it'll freeze. And as you can see, I pressing buttons, and it's not going. Obviously, it's frozen. For some reason, the ISO freezes on this USB loader. <coughs> um, don't know why. Probably because the game, how the game was like torned. Well, I torn this game. But uh, I'm gonna show you what I did to get it working. So I'm gonna have this file in the link in the description, and uh, just if you already have your SD card modded with all the apps on it, uh, I suggest to save all the other apps you have and just um, re-download them or put them in again. But all you're gonna need to do is just copy all the ones uh, that you downloaded from my file. Just copy everything and put it in your SD card. And it'll have the other, uh, it's an alternate, uh, loader for the ISO game. <clears throat> and this, w this way works. And, uh, I'm copying all the files right now. But uh, I already have it on there, so just, uh, it shouldn't pop up when you do it. But yeah, that's all you pretty much gotta do. Just download my file, copy all the files onto there, and you should have this Neo Gamma, uh, file on there you could probably just copy that in there but i think this is easier and more way it would actually work so we're gonna be back to the wii instead of the usb loader you're gonna go to the homebrew channel and you're gonna upload or you're not gonna upload you're gonna uh load up the program that i just gave you um it's gonna be the second one if you if it looks just like this but either either way it's called the neo gamma and you're gonna load it and uh, it's a little different than USB loader. It's going to show this. And you're going to go down and press over to go to USB. And then you just go up and you select your game. Mine's called Kirby Wii. You just press A and you launch it. Should be pretty good to go. Uh, and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. And it should work fine. If it doesn't work fine, I don't know. I thought this would be a good alternative way for this game to load because this is the only way I can play it unless you have a backup of this game it'll probably work with the USB loader but yeah it should be fine and uh, there you go see as you can see I can be able to play this game no problem no freeze no nothing I've been playing a couple of levels you know testing it out it's actually working pretty good so yeah, this is a good alternate uh, way to load some of your ISO games if you've downloaded them or you know back up, back them up on a hard drive or something. They don't work on USB loader. But uh, yeah, maybe um, sooner or later I'm gonna have a capture card, legit capture card. You know, start uh, having more tips, and tricks, like little hacks like this. But uh, this only works if you already have a modded Wii. But it should work fine. So that's all I got for today. And catch you guys later.